Hello everyone and welcome to the Tiny Tech Home with me, Ben Davies. I am here today to talk about networks, specifically the Unify network. I've got in front of me the Cloud Key Generation 2, the 8 port managed switch and the AC Lite wireless access point. And I'm going to show you how you set this up in less than 5 minutes on the app. So, let's do this. <laughs> Right, okay then, we're gonna get the app up and running and what you'll find is on the main Cloud Key Generation 2 controller, it actually scrolls between two pages. So the first page is asking you to go and download an app um, to set this up and the second is the IP address of the device. Now you can log into a web browser and set that up using that IP address. Um, I just find it easier using the app and I'll show you why. So if you open up the Unify app, uh, I will put it onto the screen just there and what I'll first ask you to do is to locate the controller and so it'll pop up there it's got the same IP address down at the bottom and so if you press set up now what it's doing is it's connecting to this cloud key here so the first thing we've got to do is rename it so if you are have let's say multiple accounts for multiple customers over if you're a business and doing this it's a really useful thing to name these that something that you can easily locate your customers so either first line of the address or maybe the last name of the customer something useful for you for if it's just for your personal residence just keep it simple uh, we'll call this the tiny tech home because it makes it nice and easy if i can spell it right Okay, so the next thing it's going to do, it's going to ask you to set up a Unify Cloud account. Now we've already got one within the business, so it's kind of like shot straight through to that, but it's really just a case of setting up a few details that allow you to sign into the Cloud account and manage this system from away from it. So let's click next on there. So it's found the two devices that we've set up, so the AC Lite and the 8 port PoE switch that we've got in. So we click both of those to identify them, click next. And then it's wanting you to set up the Wi-Fi like straight away. So we're going to call ours our tiny tech home Wi-Fi. Oh, Wi-Fi. And we'll give it a silly security key because I'm sure you all know that I will change this afterwards. And click next. So we can see that it's got an admin, which is us as a business. It's got what the Wi-Fi name is and how many devices, unified devices are on here. It's also giving you the location and the time zone. So we click finish and that's it. Like that's how quick it is to kind of set up and deploy one of these networks. Now, quick tip, when you look at these devices, as they come online, they will go blue. Um, so we, the, the, the wireless access point's gone blue. Uh, the 8 port switch has gone blue and the cloud controller has gone blue. Now, if they start flashing blue, they are upgrading. Um, you might not, it might take a while for it to say it's finishing up or that you can't connect to your Wi Fi straight away. Don't worry about it, let it update. Uh, what you'll find is you can still log into your cloud controller, especially if you're uh, wired hard into the network, let's say through your laptop. Um, just let those updates carry on. And then once that's finished, you'll actually be able to log onto your Wi-Fi through the password and the Wi-Fi SSID that you set up previously. And then that's it. Like that's how quick it is to set up a Wi-Fi on a Unify system. And that's what we're going to talk about this week, um, because otherwise it ends up being a 25 minute video and no one likes watching those. So we'll go through the other parts of this Unify network videos in maybe a part two part three and part four. So I'll see you on the next part.